these experiments consist in, in, in uh, detecting high order har harmonics of the laser field. So when you expose a gas of atom to uh, an intense laser field, it's possible to generate very high order harmonics of light. It's very similar to when you uh, play violin and you hit the strings of the violin with a bow, then you generate not only a tone, but overtones. It's the same thing, but in, in light. So these uh, high order harmonics can go from uh, the infrared, where you start from, to the extreme ultraviolet range of the spectrum. And it was uh, conjectured already at the beginning that possibly these high order harmonics would lead in the time domain to uh, very short light pulses. There has been several steps. Uh, first, uh, after these first experiments in uh, 93, the understanding of, uh, of the physics behind this, this phenomenon. And at the same time, the, also the realization that indeed, in the time domain, we could have very, very short light pulses in the attosecond range. Then, very important, 2001, the demonstration that uh, we had at a second pulses, both in a series and also single at a second pulse. A few years later, 2010 maybe, the first experiment where one could really detect electron motion using this at a second light pulses. And also at the same time, the opening towards uh, application in uh, physical chemistry and condensed matter. It's very difficult to predict uh, the future of this field. At the moment, this field is really exploding into many directions. There is, of course, uh, uh, atomic physics and got getting closer to quantum information, which I find very exciting. You have molecular chemistry, uh, looking at uh, charge motion at the beginning of a chemical reaction. Condensed matter, looking at charge dynamics, spin dynamics in materials. There are also uh, applications in, uh, in industry, and the semiconductor industry is interested by this uh, broadband radiation. And there, there many things happen. You have also progress in uh, laser technology that leads to progress in these uh, sources. <laughs>